How's it going everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video it's going to be a nice quick and simple one. I had a Hyundai in for a service but it also had the airbag warning light on. I wanted to try out the Top Don 800 BT that I had but I was also able to get some live data on that airbag side to uh, be able to tell the customer what the fault was. So without further ado let's jump into the video. <laughs> report so this has got an airbag light on as well so let's see what fault codes are in there and maybe check some live data quickly these uh, these times vary Sometimes they're extremely fast and sometimes they're a bit longer depending on how many modules it has to go through hundred percent So airbag Transibility control is also airbag event one Read fault code Driver airbag resistance too high. Okay. So with that, if we go back out, if we can get some information on resistance here, real time information. Does it have it? Hmm. Let's just select them all. See what it's got. Damn it. Back again. Service data. Let's select them. Oh, we do. Lovely. So we have them here. Ah, there you go. See that thing just bouncing all around the place there with resistance. I showed this in another video previously, but if you rock the wheel. And you get massive resistance change like that the clock spring needs to go so that should be below three uh, from memory I think they're around two two and a half something like that when they're brand new um, but you shouldn't be getting any movement on the resistance on that so we have a clock spring that needs to be replaced on this um i am going to go back out back out that airbag light will come back on straight away anyways and i'm going to clear all dtcs on it i just want to make sure that it's capable of doing this because i am giving this uh a full check over this is it the scan tool i've now had for over a couple of months tried it out on lots of different vehicles um, and it's going really really well the likes of that information is so beneficial having it inside a scan tool um, that's quick and simple check see straight away it's flagged it over uh, three on the uh, resistance side it's going to flag it straight away so some of these you'll find will stay low and then when you rock the wheel uh, then they go high on this one it's high all the time so easy diagnostic on that all right, that's it for this one.